Matt here at the YMCA for week eight of the Shape Up Challenge. As you can see, tonight we have something a little special in store for our contestants. We're going away from our typical workout that we, that we would usually do, and we're gonna have a little fun. We're gonna play some pickleball. Okay guys, so every week, every Monday I bring you in here and we do an intense workout. I thought we would do something fun tonight. Pickleball. Pickleball. Okay, so it's literally like the exact same rules. It's the exact same rules as tennis, okay? But it's on a smaller scale. And you play with this wiffle ball and, and a wooden paddle, okay? And so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put you on teams and we're gonna do a little two-on-two -two tournament, okay? Try, Sue. There you go. Let's take a break from the game and let's look at the weights for this week. Earl weighed in at 227, which is a loss of 5 pounds. David lost 16 pounds and now weighs in at 244. Rosalie at 177 has lost 14 pounds. Tom has lost 22 pounds at 358. Sue has lost 9 pounds at 213. Cynthia weighs in at 187 and a half, losing 18 and a half pounds. And Carmela weighs in at 149 and a half, which is a loss of one and a half pounds. So let's go upstairs to the spinning room and meet Carmela Amber. The reason I signed up for this challenge was I saw it advertised and I was thinking, so three years ago, I went on Dr. Stiles, it was a hypnotist type program and my son and I both did it. And in, that was 2011, the December. By March, we lost our 30 pounds that we were, quote, we wanted to lose. Well, then from there, I worked and then I retired two years ago from my job. And of course, sitting home and not doing much of activity. And you get this film um, blubberish. So uh, I decided to apply for it. And I was surprised that I got called because I really don't have a lot of weight to lose. But I needed to shape up, keep strong. I wanted to stay in my house. I don't want to have to give it up or anything like that. So that's why. Right. Well, I've had two knee surgeries, and one knee doesn't work as well as the other. So I do have problems going up and down the steps. I can see that I can come up the steps in my basement now, carrying things easier than I did before because to carry anything before was a chore. It couldn't be too heavy because it was too much weight. So now I notice I can I don't have those issues. And I love being here. I get in I love the people I work. I'm getting to know people. I won't feel so bad coming back because I do intend to keep coming. And I this way I, I'll feel more at home now. I did it before and I never could find my niche of what I like to do. Now I, I've got a variety of stuff to do and I know what I'm going to be able to come back in the fall and uh, continue on and stay at this pace and maybe who knows. We'll get done. Oh yes, well we liked, I like the water. I think when he gave us our uh, 
doing our trainings in the water. I like the uh, challenge we did where we had to go and do the balls or whatever it was the last time we were here, what he called that. Tonight with the uh, pickle challenge or whatever you call that, pickle ball, which to me is like ping pong. I mean, that was fantastic. I really love that because I, well, I've been, tra I've been mostly working with Destiny and Matt. Um, Matt is very good at uh, training you. He gives you a variety when you come in. You never know what you're going to be doing when you come in working with him. Destiny's very good too. Uh, she'll give you some varieties. And um, I, uh, learning all the uh, mach exercise machines is uh, challenging itself because you got to know how to set them up. You got to know how to adjust everything so you have to learn all that so that when you come in on your own so this one-on-one -on -one training is remarkable i mean if anybody's coming here and they want one-on-one -on -one training i would recommend it because that's the only way you're really going to learn what to do week eight in closing we had a great group activity tonight we played pickleball we had a tournament ashley and tom were the champions I weighed everybody in, we re-measured everybody, we're liking what we see with the numbers, come back and see what week 9 has in store.